At 9 this morning, the gates of the Red River Valley Fairgrounds will open once again for the last day of the Big Iron Farm Show. And that's where we find the Valley Today's Abby Kirchner live this morning, getting a preview of what people can expect today. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, Lisa. Lots to do and lots to see here for the big last day of the Big Iron for Farm Show. And you're going to want to come out. Like you said, 9 a.m. is when the gates open. There's just so much to do and see. And I'm here with committee chairman Dave Gertz. And there's a lot of booths, a lot of exhibits. But I want to talk about what you can see outside of these buildings. And that's a ton of different farming equipment, too. Oh, absolutely. From, from combines to trucks to tractors to... Uh, tillage equipment. Wow. It's it, you know you you look back you know 40 years ago, you know you had a, a combine head that was 12 feet. Mm -hmm. Now you walk out and it's a 45 or a 50 foot head that they're cutting a crop wow. with. It's it's just unbelievable. It, it, if you haven't been out and kept up with agriculture, you want to come out and just take a look at this equipment. How is how large and how sophisticated it's gotten. It's the latest and greatest. It's honestly what's out here no matter what you're looking at. Absolutely, and it's, you know, upper Midwest, this is the place to come and see it. If, uh, if you need it, it's here. And this is the 39th year of the Big Iron Farm Show. How has it grown and why do you think it's so important to have it year after year here? Well, because of the technology is changing so fast and rapidly and our committee looks to bring on anything or the newest and new greatest that there is yeah. and and again we're preparing for next year the <laughs> yeah. big the big 4 on that's going to be such a fun time that is because you you've already been talking about how you're going to have some surprises up your sleeve too for next year to celebrate oh absolutely yeah. we're uh, we're working on that already and getting prepared and uh, not that our show to this year isn't the biggest right. and greatest, but so you have to continue to get better. And, yeah. and that's what we are, and, and we're progressing. And look forward to great things. Right, and I think that, too, is just so important to show, too, that, I mean, the 39th year isn't even done yet, but you're already planning and looking forward to that 40th year because, like you've been saying, it continues to grow. It continues to get bigger and better. And with technology advancing, you got to keep up with it. So it's you got to start planning right away. But you're going to want to come out, celebrate that last day of the 39th year of the Big Iron Farm Show, and just take a walk around. There's really so much to do here. It, yeah, and perfect place to be. You can't be out in the field. Farmers can't be because it's raining. So go and check out Big Iron. Right. Abby Furchner, reporting live for us. Thank you.